folks who are flowing in here into what they call Potoa, 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 Potoa. It's right there in the sign there, so we're gonna head over to the right since it's over this way. So Potoa. Uh, sorry, I don't know how to pronounce that. We're in Poland, so we're heading up to this spot here. I was told that there's a gentleman that's got a farm over here. I guess they owned a little more property, but they tried selling something off to kind of build up on this area, but it's just not working out. Just need some help. So, sorry, Adam, I'm so bad with the name. <laughs> that's a nice little village area here. Roads are good, so that's good. People walking around. Cool. This is pretty nice. Coming over from uh, Norway there. Driving, riding around a little bit, trying to see if anybody needs some. Just taking some time, you know, just cruising around. Select tool. Okay. Cool. Oh, there's a car coming up behind me. Let's see if I can get into this area first. I see the house is on the right hand side, the main home, so. Get up here a little further. Uh, I said it's right past the fields over here on the right. Let's see, I think it might be. There's an old building down there. All right here. Okay, I think, I think this is it. Oh, I'm not sure. We'll find out here in a second. So I'm going to pull up here. Go ahead and hop off the bike there. I got the old trusty bike still. Um, let me go check. Let's see if this might be the gentleman. This is the homestead here. So I'm gonna go check uh, and see what's going on here. Hope this is it. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead. Okay. So yeah, just talk to the gentleman here. Um, hey, it's like a nice guy, foreign guy. So it's kind of hard to. <laughs> It's interesting, is it pretty sure you said bull, as in like Farmer Bob again? So that's kind of funny. But uh, I'll have to, to figure that one out. But no, let's uh, I said check out, take a look around, uh, whatever I can do to help out. So this is what we've got here. So I'm gonna go around. There's a cow barn back here. So let's take a look here. Oh, so this is probably basically where I can stay at here. Oh, okay. They said there's a... Okay, cool. So there, here we go. This is our... This is where we can stay for the... Time. Uh, yeah, we might need a bit of bed or something here. But yeah, this is a... Uh... Huh. I'm going to have to check on that and make sure he's telling me right... Because before said that there's a room out here I could sleep in. I don't see anywhere to sleep there. It's from a countertop, and that's not happening. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, this is the cow bar, and he said this. He had cows. He wants to get some again. Doesn't have them right now because he can't afford it. But So this is uh, the cow barn. Um, so this is what oh, this is what, what he was saying. Uh, so let's take a look at the map here. So the main farm where we're at here, you got a cow shed, you got a couple silo, small silos, some chicken there, a uh, chicken coop, which is small, uh, medium, it's not very big. Got these pigs across the way here too. We could sell some of the stuff off, but he just bought this. If we could put some of this together, man, these are some funky fields. Um, apparently he said over on the other side over here is another area. There's here, we have to come up with 42,000 to try and get... But this is where they also had another animal farm over here with some cows and chickens. And it's not... They wanted to get more fields over here. Because they just had... Here, uh, I think 57 and 54, maybe 53 there. So they got a couple of these other plots here. We could... Now, he's talking about possibly just putting these all together. Put these three together as like a grass field. Or even like this one is a grass field here for cows. I just throw hay in there from there. And then, uh, heck, we could pop it all four of those together. 
and it kind of separates out with barley and you know some other stuff for the pigs across the way too. So there's some things we can work with. So I think we'll do these as three fields and then keep this a grass one. Obviously they're harvestable right now, so we can get them harvested. Let's take a look around this area again here. So so this one's corn. This one is or sorry, sunflowers. Jeez, I can't even I'm looking right at sunflowers and I say corn. <laughs> This pretty small one here, but this is uh, some wheat here, barley. So that'd be good for chicken food. Okay, so we got some sunflowers, barley, some oats. So we can't really do much with that, but sell it. More sunflowers. Um, oh, and here's the corn. There's what I was thinking of. And then down here, some more, uh, some more wheat. Oh, that's the same wheat thing. Sorry, sunflowers here. Cool. So yeah, we got all this here. Hmm. So now that we need to take a look and see what we can work with for this gentleman here. We gotta get some. Uh, oh look at that. Very scared, scarecrow. Well, that's nice. Nice view of a pond down here. Let's go down and take a look at the lake. Fields are pretty close, but we can get this worked out. It's not a problem. Some some contracts going to help out get some money. Oh, that's beautiful. A little pond out here. What the heck is that? We're going to go out here and check it. <laughs> it's a little water, a little wind thingy. Okay, I probably shouldn't have jumped in the water. It's a little wet now. <laughs> oh, that's nice, though. That's cool. Let's go around over here. People walking around the lake. Hello. <laughs> a boat dock there. That's a pretty neat little, little pond area. A couple, some little camping spot. That's cool. That's pretty nice. Ooh, nice cabin. Must be the, the caretakers to take care of this area here. Oh, I see something in the boat here. I wonder if that's... Oh, look at that. Just got him a thousand bucks. <laughs> right. How you doing, sir? Okay. Got a little area here. Oh, gentlemen's all right. Little fruit and vegetables, huh? Trust the stucco potsky twelve, huh? Oh, eggs, strawberries, lettuce. Nice. We got a cell point there. That's pretty cool. Gotta take some some stuff crops there. Here's a little, little pond, a little fire pit. Let's see. Uh, can't read that. I mean, I see what it says, but I don't know what it means. <laughs> if that makes any sense. Oh, I've got a crane there or something. Nice. Very, very beautiful. Very nice indeed. And you can see some of these fields are smaller and some of them are bigger. Ah, stop, how about Wita? Wita. Wita. Nice, got some pictures there. Very, very cool. All right, let's go back up to the farm over here. Let's see if we can, oh, look at that, a little fish bucket. <laughs> back up to the farm area here and see if we can figure out what we can work with here. So let's go ahead and, uh... I scared a crow there again. <laughs> Alright, so... Potawa, Potawa, right there. Um... So... We're just running around like a moron. Oh! Uh, it's gonna come out and beat me up. It's like, I'm not trying to do anything, I swear. All right, so this is the farm area. Okay, that's that's the main. See some of the equipment there. So this has got to be something here. Okay, here we are. All right, so sort of silo here, granary there. Cool. Some piggies go in there. So we get twenty piggies in there. Cool. Okay, some water inside there already. Nice, nice. Little. <laughs> I 
That's neat. Talk about old school, huh? <laughs> Very interesting, that's for sure. Okay, so this is definitely a small little area, but... Ooh, got a buzz coming out of that thing. Well, let's go back over here. What does this do here? This goes into a building, right? Okay, so there's a trailer in here. Interesting, let's see if we can get out of here. Oh, it comes in. Ouch. That didn't feel too good. <laughs> oh, nice. A little grain saw. Huh. That's neat old buildings. I love these things. It's so neat. That's why I took this trip. Driving around these areas. I mean, yes, being a little taller and bigger, some of these areas are really tight, but... It's just neat seeing all this old school stuff here. Chicken coop over here. Okay, this garage area. All right, this is what he was talking about. He was talking about I put the car, my bike over here, uh, or he said down. I think over here was the main. Yeah, here we go. Okay, yeah. Probably throw it in here that way. I could, if I need to get out, I can just get out easier. Cool. Chicken coop. Looks like there's. Uh, okay. Chickens go in and out. Um, let's take a look. Fifty chickens, so not a lot there. But hey, it's chickens, you know some eggs. Cows over here, 40 cows, so not a huge amount, but said the other one on the other side is actually a little bigger, or the cow's shed is, but don't need a whole lot. Don't have a whole lot of space for it, so that's not bad. Got the silo there. Cool. Nice. I don't think we can get into this thing, can we? No, this one's locked up. What about here? No, something else back in here, is there? Wait, what's that? Oh, look at that. Another tractor thing. <laughs> Another thousand bucks. It doesn't like anything in here. This is must not be part of his property. I better get out of here before I get yelled at. Oh, yep, there's a manure thing. All right, so let's see what we got here. She got some equipment. Must to mash, a plow, cultivator. It's like a cedar there. So we got some stuff. Oh, right into things. Dang. So we're running into some stuff. We got some things here. We got some. Uh, okay, got a tractor cart. So we got a couple trailers actually. That's not bad. Uh, let's take a look. What we got here now? That's my bike. Uh, okay, two tractors. Oops. So we got 150, 117 horsepower. Not bad. Muscle mash there. I don't know what that is. I can't see it. Two trailers. Yes, we do have the two trailers. Nice, nice. Header, plow, cedar, cultivator. Okay. Okay, so we can get this started off. Um, let's take a look at the lands. Take the weeds off. Oh, we don't need to plow. Oh, yeah, a little, little strip of plow in there. That's weird. All the weather outside of the map. That's interesting. Hmm. That's interesting. All right, so what we'll do is go ahead and get this baby started, huh? So, um, yeah, first things first, we got the harvesting options. We can get started on that. So I'm going to get harvesting. We got to get the stuff going here. Get this money, get this guy picked up. So, uh, yeah. First things first, uh, I think we'll get these fields here. Let's see where we're at. Oh, we got to go with this again. All right, we got, um, oops, all right. So we got the barley, oats, and wheat. Those three are ready to go. Should be able to harvest those, throw them into here. Then we could actually, heck, we could sell the uh, oats. We don't really need those right now. I hope he knows that I'm out here trying to work on some stuff. <laughs> he said, look around. I better go talk to this guy and make sure he knows I'm trying to do some work here. <laughs> so I'm going to go talk to him real quick again and uh, let him know I'm going to start working here. And uh, go from that point. And, uh, yeah, I'll see y'all in a few. All right. So, yeah, he we talked to him. He said he's fine. Uh, he said I could go park the bike in the garage and get it out of the way. So, yeah, like I said, it's, it's hard to... Our stuff, his name is... It is Front. 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 Oh, jeez, I can't even... 
Frank, basically. So I called him Frank and said, yeah, that's fine. So Farmer Frank over here. And he said, uh, I can go park down here. Uh, so I want to go ahead and park this puppy in here. So that way we can uh, have easy access to it. I jump on the bike and just shoot straight on out. Heck, I could probably pull him from the other side of there even. All right. All right. Yeah, he said, go ahead and I get started. Um, if I do any kind of animals or anything that I need, chickens, we I don't think we can transport. We can just get them delivered. But uh, cows, we can have, and pigs, we can next. There's a there's a vehicle in the, over by the pig pen, so we'll have to take a look and see around there. But he said it's really hard to understand some of the things, but I told him I'm, I'm going to start working. He said, go for it. That's what I got out of it, at least. <laughs> Give me the keys to everything, and we're rocking and rolling. So we'll go ahead and take care of this field here. Get this knocked out, and then we'll go ahead and, uh... Actually, I think we'll just turn this into a grass field like we were talking about earlier. Makes sense. Just turn it into grass, and we can just mow it, mow it, mow it, mow it, mow it. It's small enough, but yet it'll still give us some, uh... Some hay, so we can actually feed the feed the hay to the uh, cows, and they don't need the full TMR. They, TMR will give them 100%, but hay will give them 80 there, there should be good with that. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this mo uh, this all uh, these three fields harvested. I can't mowing. Get these three fields harvested, and we're gonna go ahead and move from there. Let's see if we're gonna go ahead and get animals now. If we're just gonna go ahead and sell crops, maybe do some contracts, try and build this up before we get the animals. But I will go ahead and do that, and uh, see y'all a little bit. All right, so we're getting straw off the field here. Just went past the homestead. Got to sell it a ways out. So we're going to be taking care of that. Uh, turn here. Yeah, turn here. It's an interesting road system. I got to figure all this out. But it's good. It's good. It's good. We're doing good here. Big open areas out here. I mean, there's some undulations, but not a whole lot town and then all of a sudden you got small fields there then boom it just opened up like cray cray but where we're headed to over there at the green light in the sky <laughs> is also where the other farm that the gentleman was talking about earlier mr franck <laughs> so that's kind of cool i'm gonna go ahead and see the other area that we were talking about originally that he had mentioned so or that we heard of and then he kind of like said heard a little bit about it before I even got to the area so that I had somewhere to go. Uh, but I found the home, or the, the place you're talking about. The cows have a part, and then over by the pigs there's a spot, so. Ooh, oh, I think I was supposed to turn there. Yeah. Yeah. So I should have turned there. I just realized that. I'm glad we stopped before we went flying by it. Too far, at least. <laughs> Moving on. I took one load down here already and got a little bit more to go, but I put some into the uh, cow and the uh, pig barn, so we got some straw in there. There's a gentleman down here. It looks like he's working on something. Very interesting. But decent guy, from what I can understand. <laughs> so the hardest part in some of these areas is to understand the language, which is fine. I mean, I'm not home. So yeah, he's just sitting over here. What's up, buddy? Just digging a hole. <laughs> but yeah, it's <laughs> interesting. But uh, yeah, we'll get this up to this spot, deliver it out, and then we'll uh, call it a day there. But new area here. We're going to be hanging out here for a little while. I was trying to help out, see what we can work with here. I'm not going to make much money, and uh, either one of us are going to get much out of this. 
for the time being, but once we get to that level, we'll be able to, uh, you know, we'll get up above there and see this, and then uh, go from there. And uh, I said, this is actually the other area that he was talking about. So this is uh, where the other animals are. You can see where the pig pen is here. Well, technically, the animal dealership is right there, but this was actually attached right there. Oh, come on, I got a little bit snug there. Tight turn, I tell you. And, oh, we got it. Cool. Yes, this is another. There's a cow barn here. Uh, inside of there, you can see in the courtyard. There's a. Um, I think this is a. Oh, we can actually open these up. Okay. So this is the cow barn here. You got. Part there for it, but the cows actually show, go over there, I believe. So, um, got a little grain silo heel. Open it up. Nothing's purchased here. I mean, this is all open, but as yeah, you can see, a chicken pen here. Chicken, chicken yard. Okay, so yeah, this does all open up. I wasn't sure if it would actually open up, being uh, we don't own it. Let's take a look. Okay, yeah, a little shop there. A good area to put the bike there. So once we get a chance to get over here, I might just do that. Um, even a little silage, silage pit here. Interesting. So ooh, let me close this all up before I, I don't want to leave this all open. Especially since I'm not supposed to be in there. <laughs> so let's get over here. Alright, so we'll dump this off in this area here. And uh, call it a day on that one. We're doing doing some work got some parts going like so we're gonna have to settle in a little bit here too but I want to get something started since the crops are ready want to get those out of the ground and put put to good use um, now I got them in the silo so we can sell those um, I'll show you what I'm talking about here so we go up to here boom As you can see here, we've got wheat, barley, and oats. Almost the same amount of oat and barley. But uh, we could take those and sell them off. I just got them put away for right now. Drop this in here. Yeah, and the straw, we got, uh, was it 22,000? 2,200? 22,000. That's between the cow and the pig sty that we have over there. Not get a whole lot of it, it's just straw, but still, every little bit counts. 1200, and we'll make another thousand or so for the rest of it, and it'll be good. Yeah, this is going to be our home for a little while here. We're going to be hanging out, checking things out, and uh, enjoying the day. And once we get that main area figured out, get some more work done, we'll be able to get this back over here for this gentleman and get this set up as well. So last time I turned the wrong way, and I, got, I almost got lost. It's going to take a little while to get used to this, but... I said some of these fields are not that big, but some of the stuff goes pretty... Pretty good size, as you can see here, too. So now we're over here. And decent size. you got some tiny ones in between there, too. But over here, same thing. It's so small. Then you got these pretty decent ones out there. Just, just interesting landscaping, for sure. But, uh, yeah, the fields we have there, what we have ready is harvested. So then uh, next couple of months, we'll be able to get the uh, corn and the uh, sunflowers should be the same time in October. At that point, we can put things together and get some, uh, we got the grass, I can get the grass in right away so we can get some hay started off. And then October, we could throw in some wheat. I mean, that's about all we could do at this point in time until next year then we could put in uh, some other options if we want to some canola but part of that we'll use for piggies and go from that point but uh at that level it'll be great honk honk <laughs> so yeah this is going to be a nice little little adventure here smaller area not as big a field work with some things here and trying to figure out what everybody's saying just as long as they understand, we can understand each other. It's all good. It's all farming. That's what we're doing. We're helping each other out, and we're farming. That's how this work job works, right? <laughs> so 
so we're going to go ahead and take care of it there. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, say hello. Let me know how you're doing. Let me know what's going on in your world. Hope you have a great day, morning, night, whatever you, evening, or whatever you have going on when you're watching this. Appreciate you. Thank you very much. Take care, and uh, we'll talk to you later.